Hello everybody, nice to see you again. Uh, so today we will decorate a wall with a stamped plaster. We first uh, mixed the primer and um, uh, we prime the wall with primer which uh, has uh, quartz sand. So watch the end, it will be really very nice wall and don't forget to subscribe. So next day, for this pro project we're gonna use uh, uh, roller and several different stamps to make imitation of bricks and uh, stone. Also liquid soap to prevent the stamp from sticking to the plaster. And some trowels and a bucket. So we are preparing plaster now. Mix it uh, carefully. And uh, start the application from the corner. Just measure with aim of <coughs> fast stamp and apply the thickness uh, according to the stamp used. Uh, in our case it's about one centimeter. So we apply plaster for about um, uh, one square meter and after that we stamp uh, the wall. First of all spray the stamp with uh, uh, liquid uh, soap, stamp and wall and then press stamp uh, against the wall and press it uh, gently and then remove it. That's how we get all the way down. Spray the wall, spray the stamp, push it, remove it. It's easy and fast and we have um, imitation of stone. So if you have any comments or questions, please leave it in comment section. I will try answer. So our bottom is done, now we prepare some more plaster, it's a very very dusty plaster and start again from a corner, but in this case we're gonna use different stamp for the bricks imitation. So again apply plasters of some area, what is comfortable for you, it's about 1-2 square meters. Spray liquid soap and um, again uh, push it to the plaster and gently remove it. Other stamps uh, can also be used to create uh, some different textures. So now we do everything on the same principle. Spray with liquid soap, press and remove. Don't forget to subscribe and hit the like button. It's very important for us to grow and make some more interesting uh, projects. So we applied some plaster around and uh, 
on this splash then we use a roller to create a old blaster look because we are making mm, like an mm, imitation of very old wall with uh, some cracks of plaster and all the red bricks so a link uh, to where I bought uh, all the stamps can be found in the description so if you interested just check uh, uh, description and you will find all the stamps I used the plaster you can use um, any you can find in your nearest store so this is another stamp for different uh, uh, texture So, it may not look great right now, but um, the work is not over yet. Yes, because um, we need to make some corrections. The next day, uh, it's it's not um, it's not uh, uh, hard. Uh, uh, plaster but and we can fix some areas so now we will remove the uh, unnecessary plaster with some instruments you can use any uh, you can find uh, uh. so now we will highlight and deepen the seams where necessary Remove some hmm, some plaster, what what, and uh, after that we remove all the dust from our wall, and um, it will be ready for painting. Um, so again, please subscribe to our channel, it helps to spread uh, our video all over the YouTube channel and uh, the work is not um, very hard. Just gently mm, deepen the seam and um, to make some better texture. So we cleaned uh, about 60% of our wall seams and remove the dust, and that's what we have at this moment. So after the plaster completely dries, we start painting with the red uh, water paint. We use hard sponge and gently paint um, all over the surface. Do not push um, because we don't want paint uh, uh, come inside uh, the seams so gently spread the paint all over the surface and we get the old uh, red bricks imitation it looks really cool 
I don't know um, another color what can be used for this kind of uh, stamp and bricks imitation. Probably it is the best um, color for this kind of bricks. So one part is done and for the bottom we use um, some brown hockey color and we will try to make a, a stone imitation of this part. Just um, we need to it look more re real. Uh, we use some red um, color on top of it and gently uh, uh, paint the surface uh, of it and just add some more red color, mix it and we make an imitation of stone. Uh, after mixing two colors we give uh, the surface a uh, variety. So, thank you for watching, don't forget to subscribe, click the like button, so and look forward to your comments. See you soon.